Programming the LMI Series B and C chemical metering pumps, model B9 and C9. The LMI model series B9 and C9 are available with various external control mode functions. These functions allow inputs from external sources to pace the LMI pump. This video will demonstrate how to program the LMI B9 and C9 model pumps in external mode. External mode programming options include Divide mode Use the divide mode when the external pulse input is high. Multiply mode Use the multiply mode when the external pulse input is low. Milliamps mode To set the minimum and maximum strokes per minute and milliamps using an external source. To access the external mode on the B9 and C9 pumps, press the mode key for 3 seconds. EXT will be displayed on the screen confirming the pump is in external mode. You can now use any of the external program options to paste the pump. The factory default program of your pump is set to pulse divide with a divide value of 1. The symbol on the LCD will alternate between SPM and OFF automatically. Zero will display on the screen. To select another programming option, press and hold the mode key and start stop keys together for five seconds. The divide, multiply, or milliamp symbol will rotate on the screen. To select your programming option, release both keys once the desired mode icon is displayed. When in divide mode, use the up and down keys to change the value. The range in Divide mode is from 1 to 999. Press the Start-Stop key to start the pump. The pump symbol appears on the screen. The pump is now ready to receive external signals. If the calculated speed is less than 1 stroke per minute or greater than 100 strokes per minute, an E3 error code will be displayed. Correct E3 errors by inputting a valid range between 1 and 100 strokes per minute. When in Multiply mode, use the up and down keys to change the value. The strokes per minute range in Multiply mode is from 1 to 999. Press the Start-Stop key to start the pump. The pump symbol appears on the screen. The pump is now ready to receive external signals. An E4 error code will be displayed if a pulse is received before the countdown to zero is completed. To clear the error, the pump must be stopped and restarted. See instruction manual for more details. The B9 and C9 pump will accept 0 to 20 milliamp or 4 to 20 milliamp signal from external source directly. The pump speed is determined by the program response curve P1 and P2. Factory default values are P1 equals 4 milliamps, 0 strokes per minute. P2 equals 20 milliamps, 100 strokes per minute. The factory default settings for P1 and P2 points can be programmed to a strokes per hour response. Switch to internal mode to change to strokes per hour and return to external milliamps mode. See instruction manual for details. When in milliamp mode, the pump speed and the milliamp value are displayed alternatively every four seconds while the pump is running. To program the P1 and P2 points, press the up key to begin programming. Pro will be displayed on the screen. Input the milliamp value for P1 by using the up and down arrow using the control keys. After a brief pause, the strokes per minute for P1 will appear. Input the strokes per minute value for P1 by using the up and down arrow control keys. Now input the milliamp value for P2 using the up and down arrow keys. After a brief pause, the strokes per minute for P2 will appear. Next, input the desired strokes per minute value for P2 by using the up and down arrow keys. Press the Start-Stop key. The pump is now ready to receive external signals. The parameters to make these changes will appear for only 5 seconds for each selection. Thus, the value must be adjusted quickly. The value input range is from 0.5 to 21 milliamps. An error code of E5 will be displayed intermittently if the selected range is below 0.5 milliamps or above 21 milliamps. To remove error, 
change input to a valid range. Visit lmipumps.com and support.lmipumps.com for more product information.